Hi, my name is Novia Juliana. Welcome back to the Roman News. Yesterday, there was a murderer out on the run, but he got caught. His name was Cassius Augustus. Luckily, nobody died. Now, Romulus and Remus will tell you about the arts. Hi, our names is Romulus and Re Remus. And today we'll be talking about the Colosseum, which can hold to 50,000 to 80,000 spectators. The average amount of people that come to the Colosseum are 65,000 spectators. The Colosseum is built for execution, animal hunts, and re-enchantments of famous battles. It may look damaged by natural disasters, but please come because it, it will feel brand new. Come out and see the Colosseum in Rome. Hi. This is Maddie, and welcome to this edition of Ask Minerva, where I will, I will answer your questions. Here, here we have Maya, will, who will help me give the questions. Maya, what is our first question of the day? Our first question is from Julius. He asks, Dear Minerva, I am coming out from town, and I want to know what to see and do. Come see the famous Mount Vesuvius just outside Pompeii. There, they have beautiful scenery, taverns, and cafes. They have a beautiful sunset every day. Come to the La Pergola and enjoy a delicious meal of light, flaky fish and vegetables. They have open air plays every day. You can stop by the Colosseum to see chariot races. Our second question, is from Matilda. She asks, Dear Minerva, why is your symbol an owl? Minerva's symbol is an owl because owl, owls are a symbol of wisdom and Minerva is the goddess of wisdom. Thank you, Maya. Come back tomorrow for another edition of Ask Minerva. Hello, I'm Tushik and today we'll be talking about today's horoscopes. Today's horoscopes are if you are Gemini, you will win a huge bet on a chariot, chariot racing. If you are Pisces, you will not be able to find a seat on the Circus Maximus. If you are Leo, you will lose your job but get another one soon after. If you are Capricorn, you will see a great and amazing chariot race. If you are Scorpio, you will be mauled by a wild and vicious lion. Now on to Tyler with the sports. Thanks, Tushig. Hi, my name is Tyler. And I'm Brandon. Today in sports with the state championship between Atticus and Kato. Atticus had an amazing comeback to beat Kato and won in all of week. Today is a grand opening in the Coliseum. Did you know in the Coliseum you will be able to watch gladiator fights, wild animal duels, and even people fight lions, other animals, and sometimes brutal mortals? Murders? Now to Julia, oh, Maddie, and Maya. Hi, I'm Maddie. And I'm Maya. We will be talking about the delicious food in Rome. For breakfast, we eat wheat pancakes with dates and honey. For lunch, we eat a light meal of fish, cold meat, vegetables, and any delicious cuisines. For dinner, we save food and eat our leftovers. And now for world news with Aquila Hurls and Addie Dozy. Breaking news. Last night, we reported on a case that a new restaurant, Trattoria Monte, a chariot crashed into the windows and took them to pieces. The driver, Prater Mazur, sadly got placed into a severe comatose state. A blind man was driving and hit him, which sent him flying into this horrid situation. 58% of the people died from chariot mishap each year. Hi, I'm Aquila Hurls. Two days ago, there was a man who stole a bag of tomatoes from Farmer Pat. It was an outrage. The master at this crime was wearing a red t-shirt, black card cardron, dark eyes, shaders, and a black and black mo moccasin. If you see anyone with an unpaid sack of tomatoes, report them to the vill villages right away. Thank you all. That was very interesting. News. I've just learned that the famous Cyprian Atticus died. He will have a public funeral so everyone will remember his life. His funeral will be held today at his home in the west of Rome at 10 a.m. Come back tomorrow to see the Roman news. Only on Channel 7 at 4 p.m.